Anybody wants to dance or whatever tonight, she should be ready because she don't think she's going to make it through this. <laughs> uh, also, when we get done here, there's going to be everybody crowd together. Some people probably have to get on their knees, but there's going to be a picture taken underneath the banner here. Fortunately, I don't have to orchestrate that. <laughs> we'll let somebody else do that. Uh, I'd like to get a little serious now. I do that on occasion. This is a pretty special occasion. We have Aunt Faye with us here. And you all know that the Wookiee group are fantastic singers. Long mother. <laughs> Bert Morris hasn't forgot that yet. So we don't have a piano. We don't have anything else with us. So we'll just have to go on sheer count. But I would like everybody to sing what this is all about, this mother business. But first of all, I'd like to know, does anybody know the whole song? <laughs> <laughs> Any volunteers out there? Joey, you just graduated from school. Come on, Joey. Anybody know it? Mother. Yeah, but she can't lead her own honor song, can she? <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'll start it out, and then I'll shut the mic off and we're all on our own. How's that sound? Okay, this is all goes to Aunt Faye. M is for the million things you gave me.
Later on, I think they're going to be passing the hat to help support the dance orchestra or whatever's going to be here. Uh, now that you've had the meal and you see what loan, what might happen tomorrow, so be kind and generous with your contributions. Uh, get ready for the picture here. Does anybody else have anything you want to see before I wind this down? I think the whole uh, thrust of one of these things is visiting amongst each other rather than having somebody stand up in front of you talking. So with that, uh, I'll shut it off and thank everybody for showing up. Hope you have a good time and a safe trip back home. We'll see you tomorrow. And uh, that's me. Lima told me to tell you what. <laughs> okay, that, this uh, whole barbecue is going to be at Debbie's place, my daughter, which is about how many blocks north there, huh? Five blocks north. Well, she said five, he said six, so somewhere in that neck of the woods. And then, uh, be because of uh, a great guy that we go fishing with, and possibly one of the best chefs that we know of in this whole country to cook walleyes, he's going to cook walleyes in tomorrow evening for us, which is Greg Overby and his wife, and Lucky. And uh, we appreciate you coming. Thank you. <laughs> okay, that, I think that's a good idea to deal with what was saying there. So then we'll have each uh, person there to get something. So then we'll wait just a second until he gets up there. Hi, my name's Homer. I'm the for different colors, that's fine. <laughs> okay, then the deck. Uh,
why I'm sure it will be none of the rest of my family to tell it. Uh, since I travel, I see all the rest of movies from Canada and all of them said to say hi to everyone down here. So I'm saying hi to everybody for them. And I'd like to thank uh, Kendall and his wife for their hospitality and letting us stay in the By the way, Shirley is uh, Clayton's daughter, and uh, that's how that come about. From here, then, we got to come to some of the movies. Maybe we'll start with Harold. Of course, you all met him, and he can introduce his tribe and have them come out. Yeah. 
today, and then we've already done the last couple of panels. He and his daughters, he and Aaron, he and Mary, his children. Aaron was in San Antonio, Frank, my oldest son. Wait, we got young John. Yeah, I introduced him. 
I probably did. That's how a smile there, right? Yeah, except on the court, too. But Jarvis, he's playing ball tonight, so he didn't make it here tonight. But he's a coming. Boy, in your role. He'll be here for a long At this time, I'll call the other family up. They're about ready to introduce Marie and the Nuff family. There's Jeff and Homer stepping up into the picture. And Jeff's young bride. How about this narrator? Am I doing a good job? Well, I was the baby of the family, as you can see. And here's my husband, Homer. And my son, Jeff's giving us a smile over there. He's looking like he's just having the time of his life. And I have two other sons that's coming tonight. They have ball tournaments their kids get. And uh, they'll be pulling in. So all the kids. Uh oh, hang on, Gam. Gam. Pat and Mike will be here shortly. Oh, there's the applause. We'll zoom Thank in you on. very much, Marie, for coming up here. There's the big guy. Uh, <laughs> I really don't know if I ought to go from one of the other. I think maybe it would be appropriate. <laughs> and so I got to stay there at the, his place of business quite a number of times. But at Brantford, it wasn't that bad either. At this time, I turned over to Jack. I'm Jeff. Jeff Hopkins. Hi, Alex. That's my wife, Alex. I got to know the Wookiees eight years ago when he moved to Clark. And I'm 
must say, you're very great people. Anytime I come to the farm, they'll call me Noah's Army. And I appreciate that. I've taken uh, Dale and Lyman, John, Tom, Frank. We've gone up northern Minnesota fishing, and we've had great times. You're great people. Thank you. We'll, we'll eat from that walleye these boys caught. Thank you very much. You're the super guy to go with. I'll guarantee you on that. The only other one of these three from Iowa are four. If they want to say anything, I, you got the mic if you want. Dave hey, Macro, he is. <laughs>